First of all, it's an honor and a privilege to have one of R&B's best down here, finest. Got a lot of my nights popping with my young lady, you know. <laughs> but the ladies love me. We going to get right into Jacquees, what's going on with you, brother? What's up, what's up, what's up, it's a pleasure to have you. We chilling. Uh, listen, it's a lot to get into. A lot of good news. A lot of the news news. And we're going to get right into it. So now, for those who don't know, tell us a little bit about yourself. You know, I'm, I'm a singer. You know, I, I sing that explicit stuff. I be horny a lot. Oh, so I write when I feel, how what I feel. And, and so, I definitely get good responses from it, so. So now you got a lot of baby making music. I love you too. You got a lot of ladies up here. Yeah, we, we a lot of ladies at the nation. You know, I came we, sooner, bro. But listen, anyway. So now, thank you gonna, too. She gave me a little box of stamps. I appreciate it. I ain't need it, but I appreciate it. We gonna get right into it. So now, you got you you having a baby? Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. And, and now, do you know the sex of the baby yet? Definitely, it's gonna be a male. Definitely, you know, a, a boy. Congratulations! Ultra, and you know, the ultrasound show they gonna be tall too. So, Sam, hold up, wait a minute, something ain't right. We see, we see you gonna be tall. Well, that's a blessing. Well, now, from controversials with fights and everything going on in your career, and and. Just adversity of coming out of Atlanta and from being a street dude to going into music. Tell us a little bit about the transition and how you... Just... I'm not going to say it was easy because, you know, I grew up, you know, dirt poor and I grew up in, in the slums. And I did what I had to do to get up out of there, you know. I, I, you know, I'm, I'm just as good at putting foot to ass as I am at singing. Bruh. So definitely... It was it was a, a difficult transition because I like putting for the ass. But, you know, I like singing more, so I'm definitely enjoying this transition and and what and the fruits of my labor. You know? Now, when you first came out, you had told people that before you got on, you were really like a street dude. Bruh. You you certain days you wore the same clothes for three days straight. I said, wait a minute, wait wait a minute. When I'm in the trap, when I'm hustling, def definitely I ain't got time to go and change. I might lose a dollar. I don't want to miss no coins. And when, were you singing in the trap? I was always humming to myself because, you know, I, t I like to stay busy in my head. You know what I'm saying? If my hands is always moving, if I'm not knocking nobody out, if I'm not writing oh! music, I like to stay busy in my head. So I always hum the tuna. Now. It was either or. Uh, this question I got for my son. Now, have you ever had sex to your own music? Oh, all the time, definitely. You know, Bruh. they like to, they be wanting me to sing in their ear. I be tired because you know I be bouncing around. If I just left two two little shorties houses and I come to the third shorty house, I'm tired of singing. So I just throw the music on and let the let the track sing to her. I always want to ask an R and B singer that. No Chris Sales, no Chris Sales. Anyway, definitely. all right. So now, sometimes they sing to me. Are you still you're still with your, your? That was in my past though. Your young lady that you're having a baby with, right? Definitely, definitely. I don't want Coach Prime to get mad at me. That was in my past. Now, we were going to say that. So now, being as how that's Coach Prime's daughter. Definitely. Was there any controversy? Did you talk to him yet? I spoke with him. It ain't no big deal. You know, that's his daughter and that's my lady. So, you know, it already, that speaks for itself, you know. So that's how that thing went. But um, everything is good, man. And so he approves of everything. I don't know, but I didn't ask for his permission. Oh, well, we gonna get you out of here, Jack. We, we it's I had a hot shaving, in here. I had a shaving accident the other day, and I, don't, I still want to look like myself. It's hot in here. We know it's hot. We gonna get <laughs> we getting that work on now. If you can hear the banging and stuff. But sorry about that. But it was a pleasure and an honor to have you now here. Hopefully, you know. Listen, invite me back. Y'all got a lot of females in the office. If I break up, Bruh. invite me back. Jacquees, thank you. Thanks for having me.